Good day everyone, I am Jake Yonko and I'll be reporting about tunable focus lens for adaptive eyeglasses which was developed by a group of researchers from the University of Utah. The eye has two main refractive surfaces, the cornea and the lens. These two work together to accurately focus the incoming light to the retina which is what makes us see. But many people develop common refractive errors. When the refracted light is focused in front of the retina, it is called myopia or nearsightedness. When the light is focused behind the retina, it is called hyperopia or farsightedness. When the cornea has an irregular shape, it is called astigmatism. And lastly, there is presbyopia which is an age-related farsightedness. Now, these refractive errors can be corrected by eyeglasses, contact lenses, or through refractive surgery. What they do is that they change the focal length of the refracted light so that it is focused exactly on the retina. However, the problem with these corrective devices is that they only have a single fixed focus. That's why progressive lenses, bifocals, and trifocals were developed. With these kinds of lenses, you can use specific portions of the lens to see at different distances. But this imposes another problem to eyeglass users because with these kinds of glasses, there are only limited areas of clarity. So this is the inspiration why a group of researchers from the University of Utah developed a tunable focus lens so that they can put an end to these multifocal lenses and what we'll ever need is a single pair of adjustable glasses. The lens has a diameter of 32 millimeters and a thickness of 8.4 millimeters. The lens is composed of a sealed chamber made of two membranes. The bottom membrane is thinner. Then the chamber is filled with glycerol, which is a high index optical fluid. The bottom membrane is attached to a piston. When the piston moves, the shape of the upper membrane changes and it can form a convex or a concave lens. So in order to move the piston, they attach it to a piezoelectric bimer of actuators. These piezoelectric actuators bend if voltage is applied. But since they are curved, meaning the inner radius is less than the outer radius, then it can actually tilt inward or out by the circle. Since the piston is pinned to the bimer of actuators, then the piston can be moved through this mechanism by just adjusting the voltage that is applied to the bimer of actuators. In their experiment, they used the shock Hartmann wavelength sensor in order to measure the optical power of the lenses which is expressed in diopters. Diopter is a reciprocal of the focal length of the lens. Higher diopter means shorter focal length which also means that the lens is more powerful in refracting an incident light. Their results show that as the voltage applied is increased, the lens optical power also increases. The lens optical power ranges from negative 2.03 to 3.57 diopters when a voltage range of negative 250 volts to positive 250 volts is applied. The effective response time of the lenses is 15 milliseconds. They also found out that the piston has a maximum deflection at a voltage frequency of 70 Hz. Moreover, looking at the electric power versus frequency plot, the power dissipation or consumption of the device ranges from 10 to 20 milliwatts. So when a 110 milliamp hour battery is attached, the device can operate for 6 hours. Here are two patents which are related to adjustable focus lenses. The first one is a patent which describes an autofocusing optical system which has tunable lenses. The lens is made up of layers of electrodes, insulating layers, and a liquid crystal optical element which controls the refraction of light depending on the voltage that is applied. This technology is intended for autofocusing in cameras. The second is an application patent which describes how a continuous autofocusing eyewear is made. It says that an autofocusing eyewear can be made using a pupil tracking video oculography, a focus tunable lens, and a controller to focus the lens based on the position of the pupils. For the application of the tunable focus lenses, this is intended for those people who have trouble seeing close up and far away. This device is paired with a mobile app wherein patients can input their eye prescription and then a microcontroller in one of the stem of the glasses controls how much voltage should be applied to the piezoelectric pistons to achieve the desired curvature of the lenses. So these lenses can bring everything into focus if you are both near and far sighted. You will not need multifocal lenses anymore. For the possible improvements, Vision test sensor can possibly be incorporated in the eyeglass so that it automatically adjusts its focus. And regarding the battery life of the device, small energy generators can be attached to the eyewear so that users don't have to charge the device all the time. With this new technology, you will just need a pair of these adjustable eyeglasses for the rest of your life.